Hi guys, my name is Shane Cashin and you are watching Tennis Ninja TV. What's up guys? Shane Cashin, Tennis Ninja. Guys, you're about to look at a video that uh, I shot several days ago actually playing doubles in Kailua. And it's the first time that we've been able to play doubles since the tennis courts opened up. So you could have probably already knew that I was really excited about playing doubles. However, of course, still social distancing because doubles, you're technically still 20, 10, 15 feet away from each other the whole time. You know, just it was a joy to just relish this opportunity playing with some friends, my good friends. Um, I was playing with my partner, Brian, and uh, we took on two friends I have in Kailua, Stefan and uh, Akiko. And uh, we had a blast. We played two sets of doubles. We were both tired afterwards. And singles, I've gotten my fair share over the last two weeks because that was all we were allowed to play by our government. Um, but now doubles is allowed and uh, just being safe, but also still having a blast. And uh, feel good moving around, poaching at the net, as I guess you'll see in the video in a second. So enough of me talking, guys. Just wanted to shoot this, say hi, and uh, enjoy the video. Hello, guys. <laughs> My back can feel better. <laughs> oh, good. Oh, beauty, thank you. Good, nice one. Woo! -hoo. 
go. Wait, score. Uh. What's up guys? We got done playing. Just started playing some doubles. A few of the were in the background. It's because uh, I'm in the AC. It's hot. <laughs> I played doubles in Kailo District Park and uh, you know that court is that court we play on over there is really hot and uh, you know it's close to the sea and there's really no shade over there. Um, so it's it's um, it's a challenge mentally going onto these courts. Uh, especially knowing that you know you're not in the greatest shape because you haven't played in a while today you know got to play doubles and the mayor uh, on Oahu Mayor Kirk Caldwell was nice enough to open the to uh, issue an order uh, last Thursday I believe um, that said doubles the letter never specifically said doubles was allowed but basically it said that public facilities like the park we played at you know you're allowed to have gatherings of 10 or less and because uh, in Hawaii you know, we've been doing really well in terms of the cases on a daily basis. It's been in single digits for, you know, about a month maybe now, I think. And we had zero cases several days in a row. It felt really good being back on a doubles court and um, just being able to hit volleys aggressively, moving around the net again and the emphasis of the serve and the return and the fellowship. Even though, you know, you're still distancing. Um, it's just nice to uh, be able to play doubles again. You know, in Hawaii, if you haven't come to Hawaii to play tennis, uh, doubles is the name of the game, and uh, it's the thing to play. Uh, there is singles crowds, but doubles is the clear favorite. And, um, you know, getting to get going from playing a ton of doubles uh, when I was coaching and being on the court all the time to never playing at all to getting to, you know, be blessed and play doubles again is, uh, is huge. I mean, I'm sure all you guys around the island, if you're watching this, you know, you're, you're experiencing something very similar probably to what I did today, and I understand. <laughs> it is so fun doing this again, and I can't believe, you know, we went that much time without doing that. And um, 
But anyway, getting to the playing part, um, volleys definitely improved a lot as I went along the day. And in some days, uh, I'm very lucky that that's one of the only shots I do have. So, um, you know, that was very natural. It does feel kind of weird, though, moving for volleys again, just because I have personally haven't done that in a while. Um, but I think that's kind of a complaint more than anything else from me because uh, it's just it's been a bit and uh, you only move one step, two steps really for a poach. Um, long games. We had several long games in that match and uh, that, oh man, physically we were feeling it. It's only doubles, but we were breathing hard and uh, the points got pretty athletic and, uh, you know, I a few times even questioned running up for a ball, uh, which I don't do normally in doubles. So um, that was a true test of our stamina and our physicality uh, being back on the court. Learning how to play under pressure again has been just really good. And um, it's, it's very refreshing getting to do this again. Um, I've always enjoyed competing and having close matches like that. I don't mind, honestly, at all. Uh, it is stressful a little bit when you battle, but it's so worth it um, because that's why you play, I think. Uh, I love the battle. So, um, you know, long games, It a few times I just had to stop and just be like, wow, I this is really fun doing this again. Just getting caught in the moment of competing in a grueling match where nobody gives. Serves are coming back little by little and uh, in doubles, you know, serves are very crucial and uh, those were happening. I was able to pull my opponent around the court, especially with the kick serve and because I'm not the tallest guy, so that really helps. Uh, serve return, still need practice on that, but I was definitely feeling it today the most out of all the days I've probably ever played since we've been able to get on the court, so that's huge. Moving, um, I think forward, gosh, I looked at some video of the last time I played, and man, I never ever bent my knees, and that's usually something I always forget when I play, and I or I haven't played in a while, is bend those knees, um, and get in position, hit the ball consistently, that would wear down uh, after a while just because, um, you know, it's uh, it's something we haven't done in a while. So especially today at a hot court like Kyler District Park, the stamina is super important. Um, you know, I'm probably, you know, I don't know, I'm not the type of guy to run laps, but maybe I'll even consider it. Um, you know, but just find something out there, guys, to get in condition. I think conditioning, this is the time to do it because um, you're going to realize when you start playing again that this is something you gotta think about and especially playing singles you probably already know about that it's just so good playing doubles again and just getting to hang out with friends and talk again uh you're at a distance of course but uh just it's nice to have that sense of normalcy back just fellowshipping physically and you know seeing that you're not really alone in this world and especially on the tennis court doubles is a team game and in tennis in hawaii we have an ohana with tennis and uh you know, everybody knows everybody, and uh, it's just so good seeing people, even from the farthest courts. I even saw a few of my students playing out there, which makes me really happy. That probably makes my day more than anything else. Thank you again for tuning in today to my vlog, and, uh, you know, follow around. I'm sure probably going to be a few more episodes. Maybe I'll even do a tournament series. If there's, you know, me training for an event or covering someone doing it, you know, it's something I've been wanting to do maybe in a future video. So, you know, if you guys have any comments or um, any, like, suggestions on what you want to see, uh, content wise and you know if you want to if you have an idea for a video you know just shoot me one an idea in a comment and uh you know we'll get talking maybe or maybe i'll, I'll just go ahead and try it so uh trying again bring smiles during a time when uh you know smiles i think need to be had in hawaii especially and uh, especially for the tennis community because we've been off for a while so it's, it's nice when we have the courts back so let's take advantage of that uh go play out there guys and go play some doubles if you guys get a chance please again be safe though doing it be responsible uh, if your community doesn't uh allow it don't do it yet um if doubles is allowed though and like we're blessed enough here in hawaii uh or on oahu where our mayor says you know these kind of gatherings are okay up and especially still social distance be careful go for it man go play some doubles um get some volleys out of the, out of that system of yours <laughs> if that's your thing so otherwise you know guys uh, again thank you for watching please stay safe out there guys and i hope to see you on the tennis course soon aloha